Good evening. Welcome back to Let's Play Soma. When we left off last time, we crash landed. And so we are near Delta. We need to find our way. Do you say that? First, we gotta hit this switch. Oh, ooh! Alright. You are here. I'm assuming that's what it's telling me. In Delta. So Theta's up this way. Lambda to Delta line. Delta to Theta. Oh, so this, this. And then Delta to Theta. And this is the line of the plateau. Alright. So, how are we gonna get there? Alright, we'll see what we can manage. Now then. If I can remember where that kind of satellite thing was, that would be useful. This is our crash light, isn't it? Okay. Oh, oh, that's the edge. Don't fall off that. Okay, so that's where we just were. And that's probably where I should have gone first, but um, instead I messed around and went all over the place. Can we mess around with any of this? No, that's just the track. That's what we need to do. We need to just follow the track line. It'll get us there. Still, I want to explore a bit before we do. Okay. We were already here. I know. squeezing. Oh! Oh boy. You saw that, right? You saw Akers fucking injecting that shit into them? He got me pretty bad. I think I'm even worse pulling away. I, I can feel it bleeding out. Can you see him? Fuck! He got on the Zeppelin. He's going back to Theta. We have to warn them. Good luck with that. The platform radio is dead. Remember? The Lumar Annex should work. It has to. Yeah. You go. I'm not gonna make it. I'm just not. Come on, Evans. We have to warn him. Come on! So, what is Akers injecting people with? All right, so comet hit, destroyed most of humanity. People are trying to survive in the wreckage of that, but Acres went crazy and he's jeopardizing all of our existence, eh? It's kind of interesting, you know, we see this guy here and he's dead and that really sucks. But it's like, this is a dead human. We're not a human. I don't know, it's just odd. It still matters. I wonder if his, um, if he was scanned though, and if we'll come across his personality when we ever we make it to the Ark. Yeah, yeah. You're so full of
Um, not interested in talking to you, buddy. Okay, yeah, we're safe. Oof. Alright. Well, I really do need to try to move on, but I got myself very disoriented. So, we're gonna ramble a bit. I'm sure there'll be interesting sights to see along the way. Okay, so that's where it just was. That guy came from like over here, but I kind of want to go that way. We'll just run past him, we'll be fine. Now this is where we were. Oh, there, there it is. Okay, that's where we got it. Yeah. Get through the seaweed. I think this way. Oh, there's got to be a way up onto here. Cause that's that's like my satellite thing, right? No, that's just science's delta. Dang it! Bummer. Alright, this is where we climbed up and we saw we hit that switch, right? And let's go kind of this way, I think. I'm totally wrong, that's the edge. That's what I need. So, how do we... I don't know that going around it this way is... This is not going to work. Other way. Jump! Okay, fine. I know. Distracted. It looks almost like a door. Okay, now this is a pressurized door that actually works. Is this the one that my little pal cut open for me? It might be. Okay, yeah, yeah, and then... No, he didn't open it. This is the one that opened... Okay. This is where I wanted to find, though. So... We need the red one, right? Which one, which channel is red? Here we go. Alright, so it is turn around and like right back this way. transport theta. That's, that's probably where I need to go right there. But first... Oh, that's not gonna work. Hmm, I'm suspicious of one of those healing dealies there. Does that mean there's something in here that will hurt me? Or that could be because there's the, the guy swimming around outside. Maybe it's for... with a bleh. Alright, computers are turned off. We'll give that just a minute. There's not a whole lot else to see in here. Oh, what do we got? Uh, Epsilon, Lambda, Delta, Theta, to Omicron.
All right, and then from Omicron, we could go possibly to Tau, Phi, and Omega. I probably didn't need to do that, but... Alright then, so that's those upload transport that we maybe should check out. What was the store? Trust it shut, probably for the best. Not sure I trust the shuttle train anymore. Alright. Okay, but we could follow that line. Well, this is what... Yeah, you know, the signal strength is great. Oh, okay, is this... This is the red one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The signal strength is great at 216. So is that where we are right now? Oops. So, back. Uh, corrupt audio buffer. Restore files? Why, certainly. Alright, what do you got? You can see the Zeppelin now. Good. Sorry about the mess. Without the positioning system, the Zeps just keep losing their set routes. Volgen did say that you could have fixed it on your side by rejigging the antenna. Guess it doesn't matter now. Are all of you coming? No, just me, Goy, and Creer. Akers is set up being a stubborn old man. Alright. <laughs> uh, see you soon, Brandon. Happy you back. Peter, can you hear me? Uh, I hear you, Terry. Uh, I mean, Mr. Akers, sir. I've changed my mind. I would <gasps> like to come to Theta. Let Delta sleep. Of course. No, uh, no. Uh, oh. Honestly, didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, such a long time since you checked in. Yeah, that was uh, August, and this is the next January. Surveying Lambda at the moment. I'll just make sure they pick you up when they're done. Uh, thank you for the warning. I'll make sure they feel welcome. And then he's killing everybody. Okay, uh -huh. See you when you get here. Aww. Bummer. Alright. Echo. Ah, oh, okay. So what's it do to echo it? That's the one that we're going to do. What? what? Hello? Okay, engine failure. Okay, so it's trackling where the zeppelins are. Alright, okay, malfunctioning humans. Components, Pascal cartridge. Unspecified to Theta, but look at the date. So we had the Komorabi survey group from Theta. They picked up Akers. Okay, so that. So the satellite is seeking saplins, and one of them is, I don't know, vaguely this direction? But someone said something to us, so I kind of want to go there, even though it's not functioning. Well, although the someone that said something could have been one of those fellas. Okay, um, yeah, I'm going the wrong way, right? So it should be something like this way. But while I'm right here, I should probably... I know, I'm taking a lot of time, and this might not even be important, but I want to see if it does anything. Okay, well, this way. Let's see if we can contact the other ones. Okay, so, which channel was that? Oops! I had it, okay. So then... Where was it? Right over here, this way. Alright, so we are at 840. Nothing. Alright. What? 
I don't know why I do that. Like, the thing right here is, you want it to move that way? Hit this button. Why am I <laughs> hitting the wrong direction? You just keep doing what you're doing over there, buddy. Alright, 49. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Huh? Well, come here. What's on its way. Better get ready. Oh, man. Is it gonna be horrible, though? Okay, that's probably what I actually really needed to do here, isn't it? <gasps> Where does it land? I don't want to get crushed. She'll tell us all about it. Am I done exploring, though? There was a door. There was a door that my little guy opened for me, and I don't remember where it was. And I didn't go inside, because I was all, Oh, we're going to open all our stuff first, and I don't want to have missed the opportunity. Like, what if there's, you know, some cool bit of story in there? But I missed it. Also, if I go over here, can I find that other zeppelin? Oh, no, nope, I'll just find the abyss every time. I just wanted to get up there to get up there. There wasn't really a good reason. Can I get up here? Yes. Down we go. Alright, that's probably enough screwing around. If I leave this, I'm gonna have the worst time getting back to it, so... And that's the one I already saw. Right? Oh, this is the one. No. I keep thinking, like, oh, this is the one that he cut open for me. No, it's not. This is the one that's right next to all my stuff. It was like the first one I opened, right? Yeah. Okay. Alright, let's just go on the Zeppelin. Were you here this whole time? You 
must have been. All right. Let's plug you in. Calm down. We're safe. Oh, it's really disconcerting popping in and out of existence like that. Where are we now? A Zeppelin. Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Alright. Uh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Huh? Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. I have ah. to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Oh. Can you point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? Yeah, come the on. The toolbox over there says it has a stuff <gasps> baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to yeah. hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're, We're just, just robots. robots. Sort of. Yeah. I'll get us a chip. I don't... No, I don't want to steal anybody else's. They have as much right to exist as we do. I know, none of this is going to work. I, I feel awful. The robots only appear intelligent. They're much more like dogs than humans. I wouldn't hit a dog. Yeah. Sorry, the poor choice of words. I don't want to hurt anything. Well, we need a tool chip or we're stuck here. Mm. Take the stun baton from the box I opened and hunt down a robot with a working tool chip. Take the stun baton okay. from the box right over there and then go look for a robot with a working tool chip. I'm gonna I'm just gonna wait to repeat the stun yourself. Baton All right. from the box right over there and then go look for a robot with a working tool chip. Guess I have no choice. I mean I guess some of them do attack us on site, so Oh my goodness. Wait. We're spazzing out. How do we use the stun baton? What's setting us off? Is it this person? No, there's a there's a robot swimming somewhere near, isn't there? All right. Well, I mean, it makes me feel somewhat better that she said that they're not, like, the level of intelligence that we are. They do seem to be kind of trapped in some, like, the things they say don't really jive with what's going on here. So, I know, I'm just coming up with justifications to kill a robot. Um, they do attack us, though. So if I'm kind of, in a way, acting in self-defense, I can't feel too bad, although I have to wonder what our little pal's going to think about it. He's been really helpful, but I have a feeling he's going to... Maybe freak him out if he sees us just murder somebody. And it is murder, whether Catherine wants to admit it or not. We can't just happen to find a tool chip in here. That would be great. Alright, maybe the door that the robot opened that I can't find leads to a tool chip and I don't have to kill anybody. That would be great. Alright, that's just got the dead body in it. Oh, was that a ray? Yeah. Cool. That's a vivid one, huh? Alright, so what happens, too, if I just follow these tracks around a bit? Oh. Oh, they're there. Almost looked like they dead-ended on me for a second. We're looping back to where I just was. Well, whatever. There is a suitable target right there. Yeah. If we can't find anything... Now we'll see. If we can find an alternative, then I guess we'll take that route, but... Am I just going in a circle like a fool? Yeah, I totally am. Well. 
Alright, this is this is the edge of the plateau, right? That I keep walking towards? Because somehow I have no sense that yeah, this is totally it. Okay. Hmm. Alright, let's see. Okay, that's not gonna be it. Well I mean now that we know we need a tool chip, maybe they'll be something in here that there wasn't before? Like maybe we just couldn't pick one up the first time because we weren't looking for one, but now that we're looking for one, there'll be an option. Come in, Strasky. Can you hear me? Theta, listen. Acres is headed for Theta. Nah. Alright, pull that gun up again. Let's take a look, Simon. How you do that? It just randomly can I think maybe it's when I'm walking or stopped. Or maybe if it's a, when I'm getting somewhat near something I could use it on. That could be situa situationally dependent. Alright. So there's the Zeppelin. Let's just head off in this direction. the edge. Well, I'm really good at repeatedly going to the edge, at any rate. Um, <laughs> where's this, I can swear, that, and maybe I've already gone in it, but I don't think so. Forget it, Akers. I'm not playing with you anymore. <laughs> I mean, you have to wonder, because it's saying things people said, are those brain scans too? They gotta be, right? Just the abyss. Maybe this isn't actually nearly as big as I'm getting it credit for, and I'm just walking past the same things over and over. <sighs> taking... It's taking me a long time, and I feel like instead of just wandering around having no clue what to do, in large part because my navigational senses are so terribly bad. Um, perhaps I should just break down and kill the robot. That's kind of awful, though. Come on, open up. The button pushes. Oh, it's because I gotta. I gotta send the power to it. Did you move the outer shields? No, the shield one, the eel. Yeah, yeah, I know it's not technically a shield. Never mind. Oops. I don't know why I do that. Okay. But no, that doesn't actually divert any power here. I really want to get in there. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Um, well, okay. 
Okay, look, I'm really sorry. Why would you want to go to Theta? Why be a small fish in a big pond, you know? He's not even attacking me. Tell you the truth, I fucking love my job. I love that Delta is such a tight operation. I get to try everything here. We can just listen to what he wants to say then. Yeah, I just need a few more. A few more what? Got it. Looks okay, right? Yeah. It'll do. Yeah, I just need a few more. I can't kill this guy. There's there's gotta be another way. Alright. What am I gonna do? Just wander around all freaking over the place until I figure out where this other door is. So let's hang on. I'll be right back. Okay, so I tried looking all around, and I actually watched the tail end of my last video. Well, not the tail, but anyhow, um, the door that our little buddy opens is the one with the scummed over button. So yeah, um, there's no other hope. It's got to be. But this is a terrible thing I found. I can target this guy, or I can target that guy. So I can get the guy wandering around, who's not bothering anybody, he's just doing his thing, but Catherine says he's not as advanced as we are. Or I can get this guy that has actively been helping me right along. And that seems super cool to take out this one. He's been so helpful, so... I'm, I'm sorry. I know, I'm not, I'm not done with you. We're hurting it, we're hurting it. Oh, jeez. Alright, so where's this piece we need? Huh? Afraid of us now, isn't it? Because we're horrible and we killed this guy. And where even is the chip after all that? Do I have to bring Catherine over here to get it? I'm sorry. I'm so ashamed. I just did that. This guy saw me. Catherine. Yeah, I know. Come here. Uh, we need the tool chip, remember? We're not killing people. It's fun, you know. No, it wasn't fun. It was pretty awful. Where's the chip? Did it did it like fall somewhere? Oh shoot, where did he land? Okay, so this is him. What what am I missing here? Oh, here you go. We're monsters. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We'd, we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them, too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. Did it really it have to be done? Talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. And he was fully aware that it hurt. Yeah, well, I 
I'm sure it's fine. No, it's it's not. It's really, really not. that different from us? No. It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. You're and oh you're God, not just a robot, already? but you're a murderer robot. Since I woke up at Upsilon, I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. <sighs> She's so casual about this. No, this is we've done a terrible thing, Catherine. I think we should have found an alternate route. Maybe we could have tried just I don't know, climbing along the ocean is something. Anything would have been better. We killed somebody. That's what we did. And there's not really any kind of justification for that. Thanks. I don't know, should I be suspicious of her? If it doesn't bother her, you know, to really kill someone like that? Considered her completely an ally until now, but I don't know. Maybe we should question her motives. Well, I'm glad you know where to go, Catherine, because I can't really see anything, so it's not like there's any markers to guide our path. Satellite hardware. Simon, we got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Beta. Then we just head inside, grab the duck back, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. Yeah. We don't have to worry, though, because with the duck back, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And then... We can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. I'm sorry, Catherine. I just what? killed somebody, you know? Oh, sorry. I, I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. So? But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? Because I mean, that's what you're programmed to do. Ears, no mouth. Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. Yep. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. Makes sense. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. Yep. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So we killed someone so who was I insane. found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cool? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <sighs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. I mean, I can I can kind of see where she's coming from, where she's a little frustrated with all these conversations, like, can we just get going? We have a goal to achieve, but, and, and especially it'd be frustrating for her, being unable to, well, she was in a body before that thing destroyed her, right? But at this point, like, she's really limited, she's completely dependent on us. Otherwise, you know, she can't get around anywhere, but it's, we're still dealing with things, it's still new for us, and especially... I don't know, I'm not with Simon, like, the whole, I'm a robot, but I feel like a human. Yeah, okay, you're a brain scan. Yeah, it'd be kind of weird, but, you know, just accept it. It's what it is. I don't know. I mean, I'm not I'm not judging him against her. I guess for some people that would be a really tough thing to struggle with, but... 
and maybe it's naive, but I think for myself it wouldn't really be that big a deal. It's just like, okay, so this is what the situation is. That's weird, but it's what we got. Meanwhile, we do have things to accomplish, so let's accomplish them. I'm, I'm mostly just hung up on killing that other robot. We killed a person, and from what she just told us, most likely it was someone who had trouble accepting the fact that they're a robot and not actually a person, so they went a little insane about it, but we killed them. That was really horrible. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead, I think, and wind the episode down here. As always, please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this. Come on back, and next time, I guess we'll take a look around here. Yeah, danger. Because there's an acres lurking somewhere about.